their chance. Both teams are on the field and we are ready for the kickoff. Notre Dame will kick off. Alabama will receive the middleman for the Tide. Bobby Humphrey, their starting tailback. Very quick. John Carney kicks it deep. Way back. No return. May of 250, 250, and 290. There's plenty of help. They are strong right, double wide. Fell to the bottom of the picture. It is second down and 10. The ball goes to Humphrey this time. Cuts it back against the frame. Breaks it out to the 30 yard line for a first down. Okay, Bama! 14. Now let's see if Bell is the man. Bell, Richardson goes deep. They swing it out and Shula overthrows. His intended receiver, the fullback, Good, coming out of the line at the 20. Cornell Taylor, Mark Green line up. Behind Steve Berline, Tim Brown breaks out of the stack eye and goes out as a wide receiver. And up the middle goes the Irish. It is Mark Green, the sophomore from Riverside, California, ripping it up for 15 yards and a first of six in the ball game. As you saw him come right to you, third down and four for the Irish. Berline, little swing pass out to Green. Mark bobbles the ball and he hit the ground back at the 44, short of the first down by a yard. Lost his balance and could first down for the Irish. They come out with two backs. Anthony Johnson, the tailback. And Tom Monahan in at fullback. Burline, your quarterback. And Tim Brown is wide to the top of the picture. And down goes Burline. Cornelius Bennett. Ball comes loose. Cornelius Bennett looping around the outside. Dex Burline and the ball comes free. This guy practices every day like he's trying to make the team. He comes through untouched. It looked like it was going to be the back side of the play. It's that waggle play where everybody goes to the left. It is third down. 16. Burline feels pressure, gets his pass away down the middle, and it is incomplete. The pass was intended for Milt Jackson. Diving for the ball, Kermit Kendrick. Couldn't come up. Is fast. It is not a fumble, however. It is down back at the, near the 25. See 65 right here? He's the pulling guard. Never gets over there. Burl now, fourth down. The Irish to punt. Sorensen's last kick, 48-yarder. Richardson back again. No pressure this time on Sorensen. The kick is away. Good hang time on it. Greg's up to make the catch. He's going to return this one. Bounces outside, around the corner, on his way, one man, gone, touchdown, Alabama. Knuckleball over, just over. That long streak of 108 is now on. Second down, eight yards for Notre Dame. The ball at their own 45. Alabama leading 7-0. First quarter, Andrew Zach's pass to the sidelines. Good to Reggie Ward. Hits the sidelines at the Alabama 46. Still working out of the shotgun with Andrew Zach. See him creep up. It's a little different alignment here as he starts moving now. They almost had two of them moving at the same time time that time Andrew Zach was sacked way back on the Notre Dame 46 yard line by nose guard Kurt Jarvis <laughs> Shula's pass was thrown behind Bobby Humphrey and so second down and eight for the Irish Berline checking off. Freezing the Alabama defense and breaks Taylor over the left side. And Cornell goes inside the 35 to the 34-yard line. And a first. He should have made the catch. Right. Cornelius Bennett is now back in on third and long. Berline rolls out. Pressure's on. Pass away. Under pressure. Brown can't hold on on the sideline. Tim Brown 
Ricky Thomas was trailing. Bob's this one over to Perry Goode. Goode's got uh, some help out in front, but he needed some in the more immediate area as Brandy Wells had him in his side. You see, it's third down and five for Notre Dame. Andrew Zach options, turns up field, gets his first down, and then some. Hard run by Terry as he gets the ball to the 40-yard line of Alabama. The ball is loose. Alabama's got it. Greg Gilbert covered it. But that play was made by Kurt Jarvis. Oh, what a job. The eight-yard line. Humphrey goes in motion for Alabama. Leaves good the long back. Shooter wants to throw. Gets it off to Bell. Wide open. Al Bell. Touchdown. <laughs> I told you they would use him as a decoy. Run him around out there for a while. And then bingo. You just saw it. Van Tiffin trying to make it. 110 straight points after, and he does. At 6.57 to go in the first half, it is now 14. Tom Monahan fullback, Mark Green tailback, Tim Brown wide man. And Berline drops it off for Green, and Mark's got a hole. And tucks it away and takes on two tighters up at the 41 and hangs on to it. Berline, option at the line. He's got Brown. Got Brown wide open. Tim Brown all the way down to the Alabama 27. First down. People. And again, that student section down in that corner of the end zone gets into it. Berline's pass is away, and the mix-up as Milk Jackson turned in. Berline threw out. On its way. No good. Wide left. You can see. Surely did telegraph the pass, however. And it's third down and about nine. Shula, sack, fumbled the ball. Notre Dame has it. Alabama 11. Daryl Gordon knocks the ball loose for the Irish. Berline throws, Brown, touchdown, Notre Dame. Irish got a quick snap, Alabama's defensive people were not set. Freddie Robinson was one of those. Fourth try at 2.59 to go in the first half. It's good. Shoot it back. Dumps it off. This is uh, good. He's got a first down and then some as he gets it out to the 40 yard line. Got a minute and 35 to go in the first half. <laughs> Shula's going to stay in the air. Goes to the sidelines for Greg Richardson. Steps out of bounds at the 42. That ought to get a flag, but it does. Good split back set. Humphrey in motion. Shula passing. Touchdown, Howard Cross. They call him High C, Howard Cross. He's 6'6", 240. This is only the second time he's caught a pass this year. The tight end. They just sent him straight down the middle. Tried to split the seam in the zone, and he did. Boy, you can't, you don't watch him. If he hadn't caught many passes, you don't pay much attention, and that's what happens. And Tippin. High snap. Extra point. Good. But again, almost not. Boy, he hooked that thing low and hard. Josh barely got it in. He's now at 1-11 and 59. 
Second down and 10 for the Irish up on the 41. Andrew Zach slips. Got some room now, and he's got Brown over there, and Brown has the ball for a first down at the Alabama 34 in front of Britton Cooper. Big play, this might be the place. Pressure from the backside. Andrew Zach steps away from it, throws for Mill Jackson. He's inside the 10 and knocked out of bounds at the 5. With three seconds left. Now you've got to go. Snap is good, hold is good, kick is high, and good. And time has run out. So after the first half of play, Legion Field in Birmingham, Alabama 21, and the Fighting Irish of Notre Dame 10. <laughs> Kicking off to Notre Dame and Tim Brown. Tiffin hits it high to the goal line for Brown. Bumble. Alabama's got it. Second effort on the 20-yard line. It's a turnover, and Alabama drops on the ball at the Notre Dame 18. Desmond Holloman. Nothing fancy about it. He came up, took it on the right side. So many times, extra effort gets you into trouble because then you're relaxing, trying to get the leg drive. The arms relaxed, the ball came loose, and it's Alabama's ball. Wouldn't be surprised to see him. Richardson now to the bottom of the picture and put Humphrey in motion to the boundary side. Hewlett's pass for Touchdown. Bell. Touchdown. Possess a test of early type arm, but he is terrific in the reading defenses as well as anybody. And Albert Bell, he's quicker than Gossip. That was a post pattern. Just took it straight down the middle. Watch this. Drives him off again with that explosion. Now cuts back into the post, and he's wide open. Third touchdown pass. As Van Tippen comes in, he's got 112 extra points in a row, and the Alabama place kickers over the year now have 171 in a row. The leading Notre Dame trying to untrack it here in the third quarter as Andrew Zach goes back to throw, runs away from Bennett and takes off. He got his first down as he runs the ball out to the 47-yard line and Bennett drifts into an inside position and comes firing up the middle, hits the quarterback just as he pitches. Mark Green is knocked down short of the 45 by Greg Gilbert. Again, watch number 97. Reggie Ward is in, Brown is out, Furline to throw, gets away from Jarvis. Oh! Cornelius Bennett knocked the ball loose, but his hand was going forward. It is an incomplete forward pass. Bennett, grabbing and seven. Shula pitches it outside to Humphrey. Got him out there one-on-one, -on -one, but that's a very good open field tackle by Troy Wilson to stop him short. Of the crowd getting into it here, making as much noise as possible as Furline loads up. Intercepted! And picked off by Freddie Robinson. Furline had very good protection for a long time. Then time, Notre Dame turnover, fourth down was coming up and the Irish trying to deliver on third and long, trying to force the pass, it didn't work. Here's the reverse the other way. Second time Bell has run the play today and he's loose. And Al Bell carries the football inside the Notre Dame 15 yard line before Mike Haywood finally got in. Bell ran a reverse to the left side for the second. Second down for the 21. Shula drops. Bell's over on the side, has the ball, one man to beat. Can't do it. That is a very good open field tackle by Brandy Wells. I'll tell you right now, trying to bring Al Bell down in the open. They send Humphrey to the boundary, and Shula drops. Shovels the ball ahead, and the ball is rolling around loose. It's an incomplete forward pass, and in comes important stuff. 
Well, he's just barely skinned two through today. This is a 29-yard field goal try. Missed it. Well, how do you do? He out of the picture on third and long. Andrew Zach, a little quick pop to Johnson. Johnson was taken down immediately by, Tony, uh, by uh, Freddie Robinson. And Come back now, yeah. <laughs> Here's the pitch to Humphrey. Cuts it back against the grain, finds daylight, and crosses midfield and picks up the first down at the Notre Dame. Oh, he took his man down. First down. Shula's pass. Intercepted. Bad pass. Overthrown. Intended for Humphrey. Picked off by Mike Haywood. Haywood with a big return. He's finally run down from behind at the 40-yard line. Five for Notre Dame at the Alabama 31. Minutes after. Pass is overthrown. Intended for Anthony Johnson. And Burline is turned upside down. Lou Holtz is an outstanding coach. But it's taking time. Mike Shula, deep drop, trying to set up a screen for Bo Wright. He broke away from a couple of Notre Dame men, but one of them nicked him just enough. Number 37 got a piece of him. Dave Butler. Andrew Zach rolls it and goes deep with it, and it is intercepted. Picked off by Freddie Robinson, his second of the day. Well, he's deleted one completion before today, one catch. First down for the Tide at the Irish inside the 49, and this is Bobby Humphrey breaking loose and picking up another first down at the Notre Dame 33 and then fumbles the ball away, and somebody, I would Steve Lawrence, comes up with it. Ellis throws to the sidelines. Penalty flag is back up field. The ball is intercepted by number 34, Ricky Thomas, the strong safety. Let's see about the penalty. That may well be again three for Alabama. Shula got a problem, but ducks away from it. But the pursuit coming from the rear gets him. Number 87, Tom Gorman, the nose tackle in the first half. Andrew Zach back to pass the ball is going to be sacked and dropped back on the eight yard line. The Alabama defense forcing and forcing and forcing and forcing the ball roll loose. But... Takes off with it. And is finally put on the ground at about the 38, 39, 40 yard line. And the clock stops with three seconds. There'll be one more snap. Now they let it run out. Ball game is over. And Ray Perkins and his fighters have done it. They have defeated Notre Dame. Good football game. There will be other times. Because these teams will continue their series. Lou Holtz there talking. Mike Shula. And Al Ray Perkins.